All right, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy Rizzajados back again. I just stomped on something metallic on the floor. What is this? <sighs> Nothing here. No secrets, Sean Prescott. All right, if you say so. Sean Prescott, who's that guy? Okay, who the flip so are all these different stacks, people? So many haystacks, so few needles. <laughs> all right, you can start busting out them jokes. I feel you, Max. Let's get this just in case we need to do if battle. Zombie shows up. I have my weapon. Mm, I don't know about you guys. How, how how many of you guys are concerned about a zombie apocalypse? Because truthfully, looking at it from a logical and scientific point of view, a zombie apoc apocalypse is almost impossible. Now, I'll tell you guys <sighs> why right now. Here. Okay, because basically, for the body to like to like. After, once the body dies and it starts to deteriorate, Just it only lasts it. a couple of days. And so basically a zombie apocalypse wouldn't really last that long if you think about it. Huh. These Even if the body came back haystack. to life, the body will still deteriorate and right. collapse on itself over time. I mean, don't get me wrong, there will be still people getting infected, but... Ah, the good old days. Now what's this? Eggs, bacon, sugar, coffee, cocaine, tobacco, and milk. I love how it just immediately jumped after coffee. Alright. You try to blend it in with milk, too. Like, a zombie apocalypse, it just... It would last a couple of days with a couple of casualties. But nothing too severe so people die, honestly. And that's the truth. Let's be honest. It's not possible. My, do I need to talk to her? Chloe would make a great detective, too. No, she wouldn't. She's too loud. You seen the way she opened that stupid chest? This tractor has paid its dues. And it's overdue. Okay, now we're fucking around. I know what I had to push, but I wanted to see if there was anything else. There's no way this rusty-ass button will activate these ropes or pulleys. So let's push it. There's no way this rusty-ass button will activate these ropes or pulleys. Okay, Max. At first, we had a good idea. I was saving that button because I felt like there's more to this than meets the eye. I'm not according like to no Transformers either. Or a Michael Bay film. Because I don't like Michael Bay. Lots of info here. Leave? What's that? Oh, I already seen this. Even Harry Aaron Prescott was into selfies. Who the flip is Aaron? Who the flip is Aaron Prescott? There's my little pony in there. I already know about that. I don't need to hear it. The rusty button. Okay, there has to be something here. The ground? Search the ground. This place sucks. Every time I search the ground, nothing here. Oh, did I find something? The music changed. Oh, a cutscene. I did find something. Whoa. What is this? Chloe? Totally brand new. Chloe? I think... The perimeter maps. There has to be more here than this crate. No, I found it. No, Supermax. You can't open this with your bare hands. The pitchfork. Right? What is this? Okay, Chloe. Um, I, I found some kind of hatch, but it's locked. I got this. I hope. Let me know the second you need any help. Uh, just stay there and look pretty. That, that's something I try to do from time to time. Except for the pretty part. Hey, what do I gotta push? I connected it. I supplied you with what you need, game. Haystacks? Look. Oh, wait. Platform. It says right there. Finally, I can climb something. Alright. Climb! Chloe, can you give me a hand? Give my big booty a little bump. Just a little bump. Sidekick at your service. Look how happy she is to give me a bump. <laughs> She should feel pleasured. She should feel honored. Nobody has been able to touch my perfect form. <laughs> he is the first to touch my perfect body. <laughs> oh god. Is that a good thing? Oh cool. It's a ladder now. That looks sturdy enough to stand on. Yeah, I know. Climb. Yeah boy. Okay, cool. At least the wood didn't break through. Or else we would, we would have been fucked. Do not fall. I hear you. Now, will I listen? What is that? Take a photo. 
I'll never miss a photo op. Oh, an owl. I love owls. They're like my spirit animal. Because they look so pissed off all the time. That is definitely my spirit animal. Because they could give a fuck about the world. I love owls. I would love to have one as a pet. Nope. I can't pull this rope without tearing my flesh off. I need to hook this up to something heavier. I didn't say pull the rope, Max. I wanted to know what we were doing. What is this? Um... Maybe the owl knows something I don't know. Can I jump out the window? Hello? Oh. Look at it. Here's the other end of the rope. Oh, I, I get it. I see what I gotta do. I get it now. It, it, it was what I was doing in the beginning. Watch. Check this out. But because I didn't activate the cutscene, it made it use this, right? Right? There's no way this rusty ass button will activate these ropes or pulleys. Scope out the perimeter, Max. There has to be more here than this crate. How the fuck do you know? Tracks. Okay, there's no reason for anybody to drive out here. But there must be. Well, the hell the hell am I gonna get that? Okay, I, I need to get that hook. I need to get that hook, okay. And if it's. Okay, see, because that's connected. That makes sense. I don't use the pitchfork. I already looked at the pitchfork. She said she wants it for a zombie apocalypse. What is this? Photos? No, I don't want photos. Crates? I don't want crates. I know I, I need it connected to the tractor. I know that for a fact. Okay? Now, how does that work in my favor? I'm not quite sure. And again, Chloe gets to touch the perfect bean. It is an honor indeed. Not for me, but for her. Okay, there has to be something here. That looks sturdy enough to stand on. No, no, I realize that, Max. I, we've done this already. You don't need to tell me 14 more times. Okay, jump out the window. <laughs> no, <laughs> that's not the perfect strategy. I need to get that. Yeah, yeah, I heard it all before. Um, I'm not being rude or anything, Chloe, but let's be honest. Ow, can you help me, dude? Good evening, Doctor Who. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Damn, those jokes right there. Can I go higher? Oh, I want to go higher. I freaking want that owl, though. I seriously want him. As a pet. Here's the other end of the rope. Okay, this is fucking BS, guys. What do I gotta do? Oh! I realized it. I realized it, guys. I realized it. Bring it more back up. Come on. Come up here, buddy. Okay, cool. I realize it now, but let me go get my photo because this game's stupid. Even though... Good evening, Doctor Who. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, so I still got the photo. Okay, that's something I don't understand. When I took a photo the last time and then I rewind time, it said I didn't have the photo no more. But right now, I rewind time and it says I still have the photo. This game tends to break its own rules. Do I don't like that. Attach. You guys get what I mean, right? Like when, um... When, uh, what's his name? Stupid David was harassing Kate. He said, the stupid, uh, the teacher's like, oh, you, you should have took a picture. I'm like, I did take a picture. And I rewind time with the picture. Which means it would still be in my possession. But he's, she says she didn't have a picture. Like, that's stupid. Oh, <laughs> Jane, yes. Gene, yes. Strikes again. Can we like slide down the rope like a badass? No. We'll just drop down. Like a mixtape. One more time. One more time before the caps come. Come on, Chloe. Or maybe I gotta activate it first. Chloe, check this shit out. Check these moves. Damn, this is heavy. Alright. 
Ooh, a secret lair. Is this? If Batman was here. Oh no. Do I even need to say how weird this is? <laughs> this reminds me of the episode I was watching of Batman like a couple of days ago. Who built this kind of place? Where like Barbara finally Let's finds go. out that what Dick Grayson's been up to, the, the original Batman anime series. And then <laughs> Alfred sees her and goes, Oh, Miss Gordon, I, it seems that you found out our secret. Yes, it is true. I am Batman. <laughs> I don't know why I found that shit hilarious. <laughs> Fucking Alfred's a badass, dude. Like, I wish I had a butler like that. I would treat him like family, the way Batman does. He treats him nice. He this treats him good. is so surreal. Uh, what is this? S slap the buttons? Oh, my God. How the fuck am I going to know? Oh. Duh. Think, think. Obviously, the ones that have been tapped all the time, because that means that they've been repeatedly been pushed. Five. Wrong code. Okay. Um, let's put this one four. This one two. You can do it, Max. Oh, fucking. Okay, so it's oh. locked. Oh. Oh my God! What the fuck, game? Some numbers look faded, so I just have to get lucky. Five, two, four. Oops, bad code. Four, two. Okay. Oh, yes. I thought that only worked in the movies. No, it works here too. Obviously, when you touch a button repeatedly, it gets faded. But that's oh, like usually if you're using it a lot. How many times is this guy using this freaking entrance? Stopped and ready for the apocalypse. This must have cost a fortune. Come on. Supposedly this is the Prescott bunker? Um in case of like a Yeah, it's a bunker, right? What the hell? More survivalist supplies. Yeah, there's freaking cereal in here. Canes? Oh I uh, can't. <laughs> Boy do I feel stupid. This Dear Prescott, Nathan. as Nathan's primary psychiatrist over five years, I feel that I should stop seeing your son, as you have dis disregarded my rather dire and immediate suggestions for his and others' well-being. You know well the extent of Nathan's challenges, but I feel that you refuse to acknowledge the role you play in his mental health. If I do not have your support, I cannot treat Nathan. It is as simple as that. I fear he is becoming even more disconnected from reality. Even if he acts personable, ma acts in a personable, ma acts in a personable matter, manner, you have ignored my request for a consultation with you and your wife. So I have to assume you are no longer interested in my services. Regardless, I care about Nathan and I believe he needs serious help. If you would like to talk about this matter, I am always available. Best Dr. Jacoby. He's the best Dr. Jacoby there is. We can confirm that because he wrote it at the bottom. Everything is sketchy as fuck. Talk tape in a bunker is always a bad sign. Not really. I mean, if you're a survivalist, you need duct tape. You know what the freaking wonders duct tape would do? Let me put it like this. When I was a little kid, my shoes fucked up. You know what I fixed my shoes with? Duct tape. Don't ask me how. I was poor. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Howard Roar Construction Stormbreaker Bunker. Full estimate, one million dollars? God damn, how rich are the Prescotts? What is this? Ugh, that's kind of creepy. Talk about tortured. Someone, someone loves being depressed inside a bunker. I mean, a bunker's already sad enough. What's with the Prescott's and creepy art? How would you know? You didn't even answer freaking, oh. No, I found it. How many people have been? Rachel, I saw that. Chloe. Come on, let's see what this shit is all about. I'm sorry, Whatever. Chloe. Okay. A binder marked Victoria, but it's empty. Victoria? Oh, the next one says Kate. Oh, oh no, stupid. Kate. What's her name? No. God, I should have killed that bastard back there. Kate wasn't the first. All those binders are filled with other victims. So Victoria's Victoria the next. Victoria has to be next. Yeah. Nathan must be planning to dose her tonight at the Vortex Club party. Rachel. Oh, my God. This can't be real. 
These are all these are all post shots, right? Uh, sorry, right. Chloe. I'm sorry, but Chloe, look at her face. She's out of it. Maybe, maybe Nathan paid her a shitload of cash to do this. She probably would have. I don't think so. Why is he putting her in the ground like that? Where? The junkyard. Max, we have to find that spot now. Oh no. no we can see what he did. We've been. There's no way she's dead. No way. She posed for those pictures, Max. I know it. Please, let's go. I'm sorry, Chloe. She's. Oh my God, Rachel. No. Oh. Kate, all these. Kate looks so doped up. Oh my God. She has no idea she's being posed. At least Kate was asleep through all this bullshit. Oh my God. Let me see, Rachel. This picture is framed different. Rachel is awake and fucking furious. I, I would. Rachel has passed mm. out, and she has something in her mouth. What happened to her? What does she have in her mouth? I can't see. This shot is so staged. I, I, I can't believe it's real. I can't. <sighs> like I said. We kind of knew what was. We kind of knew. Oh my oh, god. The Apocalypse Entertainment System. This is, uh, this is a lot to take in, man. What is this? I've never seen so much pricey equipment before. Then this is where he was taking his pictures, huh? So who's using this fancy tripod? I know, that fancy tripod's better than mine. I <laughs> have a little shitty tripod for my for my face cam. Oh my god. Uh Oh my god, I can't believe it. Needles and drugs. This must be the crap that Nathan gets from Frank. Needles. Gross. Here's the thing though, like I feel like I'm not going to lie. I feel like Nathan's probably not responsible for any of this honestly i feel like well no 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 not not saying that he's innocent i mean he is responsible for he's he take he's taking a part in it I'll, I'll admit that but i feel like there's more to the story because it's a little too obvious to point it towards nathan somebody likes their whiskey and uh, if i know anything from games it's going to be someone completely different These someone we never thought all about rachel and kate kind of like with a uh, victoria because i originally assumed victoria was part of this whole conspiracy with Nathan, but oh, that last thing was about Kate. But like, mm, I don't want to point all the way at Nathan, but I feel like there's more going down. All right, guys, I'm gonna have to end the video like that. I hope you guys enjoyed everything up to this point. Um, things are getting crazy right now. Honestly, we just found out that Rachel is possibly that most likely yes, she is indeed dead. And we have to go to the graveyard and find out what happened to her. Chloe's in denial, which is obviously a stage when it comes to death. But damn. Oh my god, like, this is, it's fucked up. These poor girls were tortured. And look how much girls have been tortured, guys. Like, not just a little bit. There's a fucking roster of girls. That's fucked up. What sick bastard. If Chloe did recognize a spot in the junkyard... Hold up, how much... I better go with her and just... Get ready for the worst. We'll need each other. So I'm gonna end the video like that. We're gonna continue some more of this in the next episode. So until next time, like if you enjoyed. Subscribe to the channel. Share with your friends. This is your boy, Arisa Jado. Signing out. Bye bye Made a track when I step on the scene. I do or die all my life with or without a team. Fast or slow, bro. You can't catch me, though. Too fast, too furious, too hungry for y'all to see. I mean what I say and say what I mean. I'm the goddamn reason hip-hop's back on the street. Used to put work in the streets. Now I lay my work on beats and let them work for me. Yeah, so I close my eyes, work and stay on. It's a must. I go from dust till dawn. So I close my eyes, work and stay on. It's a must. I go from dust till dawn.